Hi, it's Kimberly at The Property Man. I'm here today to show you this three bedroom semi-detached home in Sale, close to Salemore Village. So we've got some typical Manchester weather today, so we'll uh, do the outside quickly and show you inside. So as you can see, we've got ample off-road parking here to the front of the property. Nice little front garden here. And then access to the back where we have a detached garage and also gated access to the rear garden which we will have a look at shortly. So let's have a look inside. So as we enter we have a porch which obviously a great space for hanging coats and umbrellas and kicking off shoes and then we go into the entrance hall. Okay so the entrance hall here as you can see we've got tiled flooring which is again great for low maintenance we've got the meter cupboard there radiator and access to the first floor so we've got two reception rooms and then also the added benefit of a conservatory which has just had a solid roof put on as well so it makes it a much much more usable space so we've got the internal glass doors as well on um, all three of the uh, rooms down here, which again, just allows lots of natural light to flow through as well. So number one, we have the dining room. So again, got a nice big bay window to the front there. Really great space. Couple of angles of this room here. So we are zoned for popular primary schools. It's also um, close to Sale High and Sale Grammar. And not too far from Sale Moor Village as well. So you've got all the amenities. And the other way, we have Sale Town Centre as well, which is also only a couple of, couple of minutes in the car. So to the rear, we have the living room. So again, we've got the glass internal door there. We've got cove into the ceiling in here. You know, really nice space. Patio doors lead into the conservatory. So again, it just allows that light to flow through. And we'll walk straight through here. So again, we've got the tiled flooring in here. As you can see, it's got the solid roof, so it, it just makes it a much more usable space. We all know with conservatories that don't have that solid roof, they can be absolutely freezing in the winter and obviously roasting in the summer. Whereas obviously this makes it, again, much more of a usable reception space. So again, we've got the patio doors leading to the south facing garden. So it's literally bang on south as well, which is fab. And these lights are... I am on a remote control, so there's no light switch for them. It's just a uh, snazzy remote control. So this here is open to the kitchen as well. So this has been extended at some point, as you can see. So what it's allowed for um, is this breakfast bar here. Again, we've got a range of base and eye level units, contemporary radiator there. granite work surfaces. So all of the um, appliances are freestanding. So we can negotiate those if somebody wishes them to stay. And then we have a fab under stairs storage cupboard there, which as you can see is quite deep and does go under the stairs there. It's got Box bay window and rear window there. We also have um, the added benefit of a utility space here, which was added about five years ago. And um, so again, we've got skylight there, space for fridge freezer unit and some extra storage, which is fab. But what it has also created is a really handy downstairs WC as well. There you go. So let's go and have a look upstairs before we go outside. So upstairs we have three bedrooms and the bathroom. So as we go upstairs again, we've got a nice big window on the uh, right hand side there and the loft access on the landing as well. 
So that's just got insulation up there. There aren't any ladders and it isn't currently boarded. So the main bedroom here, so I have to be careful not to catch myself in the mirror. So we've got nice big bedroom, big double room here to the rear. So these wardrobes have been recently fitted in the last couple of years. They are Bluebell wardrobes, so really good quality. Sliding wardrobes, uh, we've got a full length and um, half hanging. We've also got some shelving and drawers in there as well. Again, some extra shelving, etc. there. And then nice big window. We've got another fantastic size double to the front. Again, this has got a full range of fitted wardrobes in here. And you've got the big bay in here as well. So again, this is a really fantastic size. There you go. Just have another look from this angle. And also from here as well. And the third and final. It's also located to the front. So again, this is a good size single. Um, something that I think is important to point out in this room is that it doesn't have the big bulk that comes out from over the stairs. So often in third bedrooms, you can lose a big chunk of the, um, the bedroom with the, the bulk that comes out from over the stairs. We don't have that in here, so it is very, very much usable bedroom and then last but not least up here we have the bathroom so this is kitted out as a wet room so again we've got fully tiled floor and walls we've got heated towel rail there vanity wash hand basin wc we've got rainfall shower there again mosaic flooring and then a couple of shelves there for shampoos and soaps etc but again it's a really um really great space as you can see let's go and have a look outside so back down another angle of the um, entrance hall We'll go straight through the living room and out the conservatory doors. Fortunately, it's still raining, but never mind. So we've got paved patio area here. Again, great for entertaining. We've got gated access there to the side and also allowing access to the detached garage and then the rest is mainly laid to lawn so as you can see it's well established lots of flowering plants and shrubs and like I said it's a true south facing garden so the sun all day another patio area at the back here So just this at the back of the garage. And just a view of the back of the house. So you can see where the extension wraps around there, where the utility and the little kitchen extension are. So if you'd like to arrange a viewing on this property, please call the team on 0161 519 8855. That's 0161 519 8855 double five. Thank you.